Well, hello, folks. It's Bill with Bill Reddick Outdoors. And my wife, Miss Janice, has been doing a little bit of grumbling lately because we bought out of deer meat in the freezer. And she says, I need to quit hunting for horns and to get her some meat. So me and my son, Cody, and my grandson, Titus, decided to go this morning on a meat hunt. And we all three climbed up in a stand together. This is what happened. Well, we got up just a little bit later than we wanted to. And we like to throw slam to death because it was 24 degrees. But the good Lord blessed us because there was some deer showed up pretty quick. And we picked us out one, gonna put some meat in the freezer. But things didn't go quite accordingly to plan. Now you know, when you take a shot at a deer and he don't fall, if you like me, you immediately say, well, my scope must be off because I'm not that bad of a shot. And so you go put up a target and you take a couple of shots to check your scope. And usually you find out that your scope was on target, but not today. It was way off. So I figure I better take a little time out to adjust my scope before I go hunting again. Shouldn't take but just a couple of shots to get it back where it's supposed to be. Now folks, I don't claim to be the best that there is and sighting in a scope. I told y'all it'd probably take a couple of shots. It may have took just a few more than a couple, but we got her dialed in now. And I picked up the brass so not to leave a mess in the woods. Oh man. The folks, later that night I was sitting in my recliner and I was trying to do a little editing on my video. And my grandson, Steven, was sitting in my lap and I looked at what I had done and I had cut my head off in the video and I said something about it and then he made this comment. Well, that ain't no good. I cut off half of my head. What? <laughs> <laughs> and just remember folks, whether you're at work or play, I hope you have a nice day. This is Bill Reddick Outdoors. See y'all.